We are Corey and Julie. We are a very busy couple with a busy family, but we enjoy seeking adventure any way we can. We hope you enjoy coming along with us. All right, so look what we bought. We ended up buying an off-road teardrop trailer. Uh, we weren't planning on doing the, this quickly because we just got the Forerunner, and we just got a rooftop tent, and we love those. Um, but this just kind of popped into our lives. We were offered it. We couldn't say no. We drove all the way up to Portland yesterday to pick it up, and we picked it up, and then we decided to go camping. So we came into the, where are we, the Mount Hood? Some sort of forest. We're in the Mount Hood forest. Um, so we didn't get too far and we decided to go up into the mountains and um, find a campsite. This isn't like the most ideal campsite, but um, it definitely worked. And we're in a new trailer, so honestly, any spot would have worked. Uh, this is the exact same trailer that we rented in June for the Northwest Overland Rally. I mean, the exact one. We bought it from the company. They offered it to us and uh, we're thrilled. We already knew everything about it. We knew we loved it. We were planning on actually ordering one of these um, brand new, but now we don't have to. So now we're just cleaning up and uh, we're gonna slowly make our way back to the Oregon coast, uh, but not today, tomorrow. So we're probably gonna head into the Willamette forest today and camp, but we don't know where we're gonna end up or anything. So. We just thought if we're picking up this trailer in Portland, we may as well camp on the way back. So that's what we're doing. We love, love, love opening the galley and making a meal. It's so convenient. There's Corey. It's getting the back already. Again, not the most ideal spot, but it worked for the night. A little muddy, nice view. Yes. You like Corey's vest? Let's look at your vest. His adventure vest. Punk rock overland vest. Yeah, so his initials are CRS. <laughs> adventure is necessary. Overland down patch on the back. <laughs> the trailer is a 2018 Scout model from Teardrops Northwest. Though we really enjoyed our first night in the trailer, we were really hoping to find an amazing spot our second night. We arrived back to the Clackamas Highway and headed south. One of my favorite things to do while we're driving is to find and log potential future campsites. 
We loved this campsite. We would consider it a destination campsite. There was lots of room. It was right next to the river, though there was a steep cliff to the river. Um, but it was wonderful water sounds and it was just perfect. Right next to that spot was another amazing campsite. This would actually be a great area for our group to camp. Okay, so we just went through uh, Detroit, Oregon. We got gas and we got some firewood and now we are going to head towards the Willamette National Forest. Uh, see about staying the night there. So right now we're on Highway 22 East and we're gonna make our way to Highway 126 and then uh, find some forest roads from there. I own this book that actually states where campsites are around certain areas in Oregon. So we thought we'd check one of those out. As we got farther and farther away from the highway, I actually wondered if we'd find what the picture shows in the book. And we did. It was such an amazing campsite, we had to stop. It was only 3 p.m., but it was fine by us. This campsite was amazing. We'll definitely be going back to this one. It felt like we had our own private lake. We decided to open a nice bottle of Pinot and just relax. I couldn't believe how perfect this campsite was. I mean, it had the lake, it had a large area, it had a fire pit, a picnic table. It was awesome. Oh, and there were no mosquitoes.